exporter of unconventional gas. Its roadmap to unconventional gas heads in the wrong way from a clean energy future, and it will lead to more fuel burning, more fugitive emissions from piping networks, from gas seeks, from dewatered gas bearing formations, and from geological faults. I have a different vision for a roadmap to a renewable energy and a low carbon future in South Australia. It should be implemented as quickly as possible and fully achieved by mid-century. In my vision, we will have renewable electricity generation above 50% per year with longer periods where we export our excess wind and solar energy to other states by 2020. We will achieve a 40% reduction of the state's emissions not only from our renewables but by ensuring that all new major projects support greenhouse reduction efforts. Our electric rail and train network will be run on green power renewable energy. We will see many new electric car and moped parks with solar charging stations. The first large scale concentrated solar thermal power station will be built near Port Augusta and community and large regional scale photovoltaic projects will be thriving. Low carbon manufacturing will be expanding rapidly.